Greetings family, this is Bomani Tamba and we're at the Avery Wood Carving Village. And I got one of my good Rasta brothers. Yes man, I've known you for a while, I've seen you here so many times. Yeah, truly, truly. Yeah, so since we have seen you so many times, we just want you to give a good introduction of who you are and where your shop is and what this wonderful wood carving community is all about. Yo, well, I'm a Sean Wilson. I'm a white tourist guy. I'm a grocery carver in every white junction. Yeah. Crab village, you have a lot of products. You have, you have paintings, you have wood works, you have etc. We do a lot here. Welcome all the tourists to get what they say fashion to them. So every year they come around to buy something small, small for us. We appreciate them. They are good people to us. So we welcome them. Whenever they come to we make them discount so that they buy more for us. So that's it. Uh, yes, my brother. And yeah, I, my how long? How long has this wood carving village been open? Because I remember coming in 2006 for the first yeah, time, yes, and then it was different. Yes, remember? Yes. Well, yeah, because you guys, you guys is on the roadside, yeah. and then uh, this community was developed uh, a few, uh, a few years later. Yeah. I don't remember the exact uh, year. Okay, we, we moved on in about seven years now. We are here. Yes. So 2016, we are on the roadside. Now we move in because the government helped me to build this structure for us so that when the tourists come with the case, they can play around. So we get a good place to park their car. Yeah, we get have a good the, the space to spin the big yeah, bus. So that the kids can play a lot. That's why we came in and we tell the government that you come now and to help we. So the tourists come to, they get everything they need to satisfy them. So we are welcome every day. Yeah, sure, my brother. Yeah, so, so family, earlier we gave you a nice little tour around and we did as much videos as we can with the, with the name and the numbers and of different shops. But one of the things, um, you seem to be a leader energy here. One of the things I'm recommending that everyone do is put name, numbers, and email address, and information on their shop. That way when we come and if we take a picture or video, when it gets around, you, know, you just never know who see information. Okay. Yeah? So that's my greatest recommendation and we have to always keep elevating to the highest level, family. That's it, we do, we, 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 it doesn't matter where we start from, but we just work our way up and keep building. You know, like, like we talk about roots and culture. They lock in the roots of the foundation, and you just build strength. So yes, family, keep it strong. One low still.